Guys, are you ready to see us open up our very first three liter soda? Let's go. What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today we have a huge soda unboxing that we're going to be bringing to you guys and this will include the opening of our very first three liter soda. Right off the bat, this thing is absolutely massive and I cannot wait to rip into this to see if we are the one of the lucky few to actually pull a chase. I have not seen many people pull an Iron Giant chase. But before we get to that, we have 10 regular sodas that I want to rip open. They are full of newer characters that I don't think a lot of people have seen. And we have not ripped any of these here on the channel yet. So we're going to start cranking through those. And we're going to start it out with... Donald Duck right here. Donald Duck was a D23 Expo exclusive, international version limited to 15,000 pieces. He has a super cute flocked chase and uh, we're going to see if we can find it. If this is your first time here on our channel guys, make sure to smash that subscribe button because we do a ton of Funko content and you're definitely going to want to make sure you're subscribed, especially if you're a soda collector because we have a massive soda video dropping this Friday that you guys are not going to want to miss. So here we go. Let's kick it off with Donald here and let's see if Donald is a chase. No chase on Donald, one out of 12,500. Got the colored pog. Now all these sodas that I'm gonna be ripping today are international versions, except the Iron Giants. So we're looking for the white pogs. But we're gonna show off every single soda figure for you guys. Man, the bag is really warped here on Donald. He is super cute. I know a lot of Disney fans were excited to get him in the collection. Hopefully you guys have some on the way from the D23 drop last week. We were able to get a Baymax three liter soda. So this Iron Giant three liter will be probably the first of many that we will be opening here on the channel. They also just released the images for the Wampa three liter soda and I am very, very excited about that. All right, next soda we have is from Wreck-It Ralph and we actually have Fix It Felix. Fix It Felix was limited to 6,500 pieces here. So not many of Fix It Felix. And we're looking for the chase of him holding the hammer. So here we go. Let's see if we got a chase. No chase on Fix It Felix. One out of 5,450. Kind of a weird number there, but that's what Funko likes to do sometimes. But we're going to show him off because he is really cute. And you definitely got to get him if you're a Wreck-It Ralph fan. His black bag, thankfully, wasn't too bad. And here we go. Here is Fix-It Felix. I love his little hat. He's got his logo on there and everything. Super awesome. All right. Also in the Wreck-It Ralph family, next up we have the adorable... Vanellope. Check this out, guys. Super cute. We absolutely love this soda. She's limited to 7,500 pieces. So let's see if we can pull her chase. The chase is her holding the candy heart. So really hoping we can pull that. All right, here we go. Third soda in. We got 10 regular size sodas to rip. We need a chase, guys. And this one is not a chase. Vanellope. One out of 6,500, excuse me, 6,250. But honestly, both the common and the chase are equally adorable. She's tiny, but check out Vanellope here. Look at all the candy in her hair. That's my favorite part. Funko did a great job. She's got a nice, cute little ponytail there. Great job on this one, Funko. Super cute. That is Vanellope. And she, of course, goes great with Fix It Felix. All right, next up, come on, we gotta step up the heat here. We have my man Frozone from The Incredibles. He was also a D23 exclusive. I really need this chase. We have not pulled the chase here for Frozone for our personal collection. So I really need the chase. The chase is him shooting Ice Blast out of his hands. And I love The Incredibles. The Incredibles is one of my favorite movies of all time. And uh, I really need this chase. So here we go. 
No, Frozone. Frozone is just the common one out of 12,500, but I love the way they did the pog, and uh, you have to have the common. You gotta have it. They're gonna be dropping Mr. Incredible, probably Elastigirl at some point soon, so you gotta make sure you have Frozone. So there he is. There is Frozone. All right. So far, no chases, so we need to step up our game here. Why don't we jump on over to one of the ones I was very excited for cracking open in today's video. We have the D23 Philharmagic Mickey Mouse. So this chase, of course, is a nice glitter chase, and uh, they just did a great job on this one. So hopefully we can pull the chase, guys. Here we go. Philharmagic Mickey Mouse. And this one is the common. One out of 10,500 pieces. All right, but we're gonna take them out of the black bag. So, so far, halfway through our regular sodas, and no chases yet. So hopefully we're saving our chases here for the second half of the video. That's okay if we don't pull any chases. I would still love just to pull the Iron Giant chase. That would be killer. Here is Philhar Magic. Mickey Mouse. I love his hat. Of course, he's got his nice little suit on and the wand, of course. Freaking awesome. All right, guys. So by this point in the video, some of you have probably noticed that I am wearing a pretty sweet Slapshot Pops customized hockey jersey and today's video is actually sponsored by DOJ DIYOJ and they make custom sports jerseys and apparel and they're absolutely amazing if you're a hockey player football player baseball player or even a soccer player you definitely need to go check out their website because they make incredible customized jerseys and apparel that you can use for your organizations organizations and teams at home and guys check this out they even put 20 on the sleeve which of course is when the Slapshot Pops channel was born back in 2020 they got the nice Slapshot Pops wording right across the front they have our logo up here and they overall just did an amazing job so we are very thrilled with it as a hockey player basically my entire life I have worn hundreds of jerseys and I got to say the quality of this jersey is nice and light and durable and it's something that I really enjoy so if you guys are interested in checking out DIY OJ make sure to head on over to their website and enjoy 10% off with our discount code slapshot pop the link to their website is in the description below, complete with the discount code, and their prices are actually very reasonable. The customized jersey, everything that you see on here, all the printing, everything, ran us about $85. So shout out to them. Uh, hockey jerseys especially can be upwards of $250 these days, especially if you're trying to get a customized one. So big shout out to them. We would love to buy more apparel from them and maybe even get some customized stuff for the channel to give away to you guys. And uh, we look forward to working with them more in the future. All right, let's get back to the sodas. We got five more that we need to rip here. And I think the next one we're going to go with is the Predator Soda, guys. This one is super cool. The mold is ridiculously awesome, limited to 8,000 pieces. I'm not even a horror fan. I've never even seen any of the Predator movies, but I can appreciate a really good soda mold when I see it. And when I saw this soda on Rock and Rose channel for the first time, I knew this was one we had to have for the collection. So here we go. Predator. And you know what? Predator is the common one out of 6,700, but that's okay because I actually like the common better. The chase is pretty awesome, but the common you guys will see in just a quick second here. He has his mask on. Guys, look at the detail for Predator here. The dreadlocks, all the accessories on him, his weapons, of course. They just killed it with Predator. So once again, shout out to Funko. They're definitely stepping up their game on some of these sodas. All right, we got four sodas left. I have Jimi Hendrix, Sauron, Lab Crunk, and I also have another big one here, the brand new Misfit Elephant from Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. I think I'm going to be saving that for towards the end. Let's crack open a Funkon exclusive Jimi 
Hendrix. You guys have no idea how nervous I am to crack open this Iron Giant. It's insane. I've been looking forward to this video for a long time and we got a huge shout out to do to the person who was kind enough to send this one over. So here we go, Jimi Hendrix, we're looking for that bronze chase. So far we're 0 for 6 and it looks like we're 0 for 7. One out of 8,400 pieces here on Jimmy. Just like the Predator, I actually do like the Jimi Hendrix Common better than the Chase just because I think there's more detail and I like all the colors on him. Look at him holding his guitar and everything. Freaking awesome. All right, so that is Jimi Hendrix. We got three more. Let's move on over to a D23 exclusive. Once again, we have Lab Crunk from the Emperor's New Groove. Look at that. Got the D23 Expo sticker right on there. Here we go, let's rip it guys. Lab Crunk, we're looking for that glow in the dark chase where he's actually holding the beaker. So here we go. And this one is the common. I'm, I'm really hoping we're saving our chase luck for the end of the video guys. One out of 6,700 pieces. Now I do know that there were some people that were excited about this one just so they could put it with their Yzma soda. And overall, it is a cool Disney soda. So there is Lab Crunk from The Emperor's New Groove. All right, let's get back him back in his baggie. We got two left, and they're both they're both big ones, guys. We have Sauron from Lord of the Rings, and the hype for this one has been through the roof, guys. Check it out. We got the Lord of the Rings logo right there on the back. This is one out of 8,000 pieces. Let's get this ripped open here. Now, just like Predator and some of these other sodas we've talked about today, the, uh, the detail on this one, the mold is absolutely insane. And this one is a common. One out of 6,700. Look at that pog. All right, let's check him out. Brand new Sauron from Lord of the Rings. Got to get him to go with Frodo. You got to get him to go with Bilbo Baggins, which they dropped for San Diego Comic-Con. And it's just killer. I am not the biggest Lord of the Rings fan. However, check this out. Look at this mold. All of the detail, all of the spikes coming off of him and his armor. He has his black cape. Absolutely crazy. So, if you're a Lord of the Rings fan, this is definitely a must-have. All right, we got one more regular soda left, and this is a really cute one. Misfit Elephant from Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. And this is 5,000 pieces. We are looking for a flocked chase on this one. It's a really tiny soda. As you guys can see, it barely takes up half the can. But we're gonna pull it here. I really want this chase. I want it to show off for you guys right here on the channel. So here we go, let's do it. Oh, I think we did. I think, we, yes, we got it. We got a chase on the last one. One out of 800 pieces. Let's go, flocked misfit elephant. All right, if there was a chase to pull out of all 10 of these, this is definitely the one. Let's go. Oh my gosh, guys, the flock job on this little guy, super cute. I think people are going to be going nuts for this one when we get closer to Christmas. So there it is, guys, the flocked misfit elephant, one out of 800 pieces. Let's go. One out of 10 is not great, but this is a big soda. And I know Joanna's gonna be thrilled about this little guy for our collection, so. All right, now it's time to move into the main event. Our very first three liter soda opening here on the channel. And uh, I actually have to give a huge shout out to one of our amazing Slapshot Pops family members, my man, Kason. He sent this thing over, we worked out a trade. I was able to give him something he needed for his Star Wars collection, and he managed to get a few of these off the Funko Shop, 
and uh, he was kind enough to keep us in mind. So we're gonna bust this open in just a sec. He did send over something else as well as a little note. He says, Dear Slap Shop Hops, I hope this package gets to you well. I am so glad I could help you guys out by getting this for you and your collection. Since you wouldn't let me just give it to you, I didn't. I didn't. I, this was too big to accept. I decided to throw in an extra gift that I happened to have lying around. I had two, so I wanted to share one. If you already have it, then feel free to re-gift it or give it away to somebody you know that will love it. Best of luck on your chase hunt. I got the common, so hopefully you guys get the chase. We love you. You guys rock. Don't stop shooting until you score. Kaysen. All right. Well, thank you so much, Kaysen. We're going to open up this little, uh, looks like it's another soda, which is amazing and very thoughtful of you and perfectly timed for today's video. So from what I'm seeing here, it looks like it's the Klondike Cat soda, which is pretty cool. Very limited. This is 3,500 piece Klondike Cat. And let's see what's inside here. And it is the chase, guys. We got the flocked Klondike Cat, which is honestly amazing. We never pulled this. We never pulled this for our personal collection. Check that out, guys. Flocked Klondike Cat. We're keeping the Flockness chase streak alive. First, we got the Misfit Elephant, and now we have the Flocked Klondike Cat. Look at that. One out of only 600 pieces. So thank you so much, Kaysen. Did not have to do that at all. Incredibly kind of you. And yes, this will be going into our personal collection. So that's awesome. All right, here we go. The Iron Giant. Funkon exclusive. Very limited on this one. Only 6,500 pieces. Now I've seen several people open this on YouTube, so bear with me. I'm gonna try my best to crack this open here. It's not like the traditional sodas where you open them from the top. These you actually open up from the bottom. So I got the first wrapper off. And then if you guys haven't seen this yet, there are some, some push inserts here on the bottom. And from what I've seen, you kind of just like push and twist. You know, when I was watching the uh, the Funko reveal of this, I felt bad for the girls, but yeah, this was a little bit tougher to get open than your regular soda. So there's four points that you have to push all of them in and then the soda will slide right out. So here we go, guys. First three liter soda. Let's see what we're going to get. And this is the common but still this is pretty awesome the iron giant will take out the pog and everything this thing is huge look at this this thing is massive we just skipped one liter and two liter we went right to three liter Funko this is crazy but the detail on this guy is pretty awesome so here we go I'm gonna rip open the pog here this pog is huge look at this it's a coaster not even a pog anymore. One out of 5,450. Here is the Iron Giant and uh, Kaysen. Thank you so much for helping us out. We now have our first three liter in our collection. And um, I'm actually really digging the figure. I'm not gonna lie guys, this, this bottle is obnoxious. It's just huge, but I understand you know why they have to make it this big. And uh, I'm very excited for the future of the three liter sodas. I don't know where we're gonna keep all these bottles, but uh, I'm definitely gonna be keeping the Iron Giant here out of its can, or out of its bottle at least, because you have to put it on display. So Kaysen, thank you so much. That was a lot of fun to open. Um, Klondike Cat here was an incredible gift. Guys, big shout out to DIY, uh, DIY 
OJ for sponsoring today's video and sending over this magnificent jersey. I can't wait to wear it at New York Comic Con and uh, definitely going to be sporting it in future videos. So if you guys enjoyed watching this giant soda unboxing, make sure to smash that subscribe button and let me know down in the comments section below which soda out of the 12 sodas that we cracked open today was your favorite. I'm very excited for the future of Funko Sodas and uh, I definitely think there's going to be a lot of hype down the road. So thank you guys so much for watching. As always, don't stop shooting until you score, and we'll see you all very soon.